Here's an overall view of my gasoline distillation apparatus. Here are the water connections to the condenser. Here's the K-type thermocouple. And right here we're going to put in about 4,000 milliliters of regular unleaded gas, ethanol free. You notice the uh, sealant on the connection. You want everything to be airtight. The picture only holds 2,000 milliliters, so we put it in twice for a total of 4 liters. You notice the gasoline has a little bit of yellow tint to it. There, put the lid back on, get it good and tight. Now we're setting the end point of the uh, PID temperature control. We're going to set that at 155 degrees Celsius. Now we're going to turn on the water flow to the condenser. I'm just using a five gallon bucket here. Seal everything up, close it off with uh, thermal bricks. Water's flowing good, temperature's good. These fumes that you see mostly are butane that's uh, dissolved in the gasoline. Temperature's up to 31 degrees now and it's flowing pretty good. The first uh, drops came off at 23 degrees Celsius. Now here here I am taking off, uh, this is fraction number two. Fraction number two came off at 96 degrees Celsius. So I'm going to take that off and measure it. Got a graduated picture here and that's uh, fraction number two measured 800 milliliters. And that's mainly uh, six carbon molecules and, and lower. There were a total of five fractions and the total volume was uh, 3,100 milliliters. This is the dregs. This is what's left over. It's approximately 500 milliliters. So if you do the math on that, 3,100 milliliters and 500 milliliters, that's 400 waste. Now we're going to see if it works. Put it in my 69 220, pump it up, light a match to it, and away it goes. Works pretty well. This is the uh, second time I've used it in this lantern. The generator is a little bit dirty on it from just using it in the past. It's kind of old, so <clears throat> got to pump it up quite a bit. And clean out the generator. And there you go. Works like a charm. Thanks for watching.